I got a new camera and a new unboxing. So if you want to know what it is, you'll just have to stick around. This video is sponsored by PGX Grading Services. Get 10% off your first submission by using the code WELOVECOMICS10% on your order form. Link in description. Hello everybody, my name is Chris, and of course this is We Love Comics. And look at this, we have another box to unbox. And as you can see on the cover screen here, that it is actually a different type of unboxing. This is a key issue, of course, but it's... Not a Marvel, not a DC, and not a book that I normally would think I would get, but I saw it for a pretty decent price. It's a Silver Age book, and I wanted to get this, and uh, this is definitely one I think if people see it, they might get it too. Uh, it is a key issue, and as usual, I want to let everybody know that I do a surprise subscriber shout out at the end of every video. All you have to do is be a subscriber and you could potentially get one. If you want one, just leave it in the comment section. Let me know and I will try my best to speed the process up as fast as I can. All right, so we basically have to find out where the comic is. So they did actually a pretty good job of getting this wrapped properly. I always appreciate that. And also, let me know what you think about this new camera. Um, I'm going to use the other one for the live shows because for some reason it would work great live. But when I tried to do a regular video, it would not come out. I didn't understand that. So I had to buy a new camera. And you'll have to let me know both audio and video if you think this one is at least watchable. And uh, I don't... I guess they said they did a lot of clicking or something. When the uh, when I guess when I was too close because it was just a regular camera, not a camera phone, but a regular camera, and um, it had one of those built-in microphones. Boy, they really uh, did a good job here. They basically had one of those built-in cameras, and you know, quality on those are subpar to say the least. So let's try and get this out without completely destroying it. So they did a pretty good job getting this protected, so protected that you can't even get it out. So, bear with me with this a moment. Alright, and there we go. That was dramatic. Alright, so let's go in for the close-up. And let's show the comic that I am proud to now add to my collection. And as we see here, let me zoom in a little bit. This is Vampirella, issue number one. Now let's do some close-ups here so you can get a general idea of this book. Absolutely love this cover. This is the first appearance of Vampirella. I think this came out in, I think, 69, but don't quote me. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. But um, it's got like a very painted like cover i don't know this, who's the artist if uh one of my sub smart subscribers knows please fill us in on the details with that but uh as soon as i saw this I had to get it um it's got some ticks along the spine you know this is not a 9.8 by any means there's some ticks along the edges as well um as you can see here in the corner rounded corner a little bit of a dog ear flip there Actually, it looks like a little piece might be missing. So I would say this is probably a 6.5 range. Uh, this is one of the books I will eventually get graded, but uh, definitely thought that this would be a great addition to my collection, and I'd love to know what you think. So let me know what you think about the actual book itself. Let me know what you think about the video, if you think this camera is a keeper. And uh, don't forget to wait until the end for the surprise subscriber shout-out. And don't forget, it's not you, it's not I, it's We Love Comics. I'll see you next video. And we're just going to do a zoom in for all the guys. You're welcome.